What is up there everybody? Welcome back to another exciting episode for the channel and to continue your Pokemon journey. So today we are going to see if it was worth purchasing this item from Sam's. And the item of course today is the Tyranitar and Lucario box. This thing is absolutely huge. It has a bunch of packs in it. So I want to put it over here to the side so I can pull all the packs out and get them lined up for you. But I will show you all the promo cards that come with it and everything else. So I will be a little bit over here off camera because it's just too big for the um, this desk right there. And they actually taped this. First time I've actually seen tape on one of these. Right. And they tape super glued and duct tape. There we go. Put that right there for now. All right. This thing is just absolutely massive. Dang it. Everything is taped in this. Even the cards were taped in it. code card for the box these are the coins that come in this they have Pikachu Charizard score bunny I believe and Eevee put them over here to the side you have a jumbo sized card of Lucario V from Astral Radiance, by the way, even though it's not a playable card. Put that over there with the other jumbos. All right, sorry. Ah. As you can see, it had a lot of packs in it. <laughs> okay, so. Our cards are Lucario, Tyranitar V, whoops, Tyranitar, and Lucario V. And these are actually the regular cards, if you can see. These are not promos right here based at the bottom. These are the actual regular cards from those sets. So let's go ahead and try and get these together here. Several Tempest, Astral Radiance, Lost Origin. Let's see, Astral Radiance. We have some Brilliant Stars, Chance at another Charizard. Astral Radiance and Brilliant Stars. Okay, so we'll do Silver Tempest, Lost Origin first because that's three packs a piece, and then the last two are four packs a piece. So that's how we will do this arrangement. First is Silver Tempest. Let's go ahead and get those three packs out of the way. And I forgot one of my videos to put the uh, cost. This was $40 at Sam's Club. So we will again weigh the prices as always. You will see the prices at the bottom of the screen. And we'll go from there. Dragonair, Toxicroak, Sunkern, Fanfe, Ndidi, Marini, Mistrevis, Reversolo Mungus, and a Noivern. But that is how I always judge it is based on the price. However, if y'all thought because of what cards you got, even if they didn't outweigh the cost of purchasing the item that it was a good thing then that means you lucked out but this is how i do it to determine if it was worth it fighting energy whale lord raichu torcat sendile finnegan murkrow beldum Botoy, reverse hollow fortune and oh there we go a rainbow rare wallace which i do need for my set Nice. That is a beautiful card. Right there. All right. Depending on the price, that might have just got, <laughs> might have just got us way up there. There's your code card right there. Energy. 
We have a Raichu, Torticat, Polisand, Stunfisk, Tukadamaru, Esper, Smeargle, Litten, Reverse Holly Noivern, and oh, there we go! A Gold Superior V Star. Nice, beautiful card. So we have struck gold. All right, we are on to Lost Origin packs. Again, three packs, and then we'll move on to the others. There's your cook card right there. Cook card, get your cook card. Foul ball. No, just kidding. All right, here we go. Energy. Lost Vacuum. Silcoon. Lady. Hiswain Zerua. Snover. Machop. Pikachu. Jinx. Reverse Hollow Ariodos and a regular Parasect. Alright, on to pack number two of Lost Origin. I still have quite a few cards in Lost Origin to get. There's your coop card right there. Alright, Water Energy. We have a Lampant. Gift Energy. Lost City. Meditite, Shellos, Mindful, Litleo, Ghastly, Reverse Hall Lake Acu Ac blah. Lake Acuity, and a regular Ariados. I could not get that word out to save my life. Acuity, Acuity. Did I just say Acuity? Acuity. Ugh. Actually, you know what? Just for the fun of it, we're going to call it Acuity. Beware the Akutis. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Dark Energy. We have a Torkoal. Erezu. Relicanth. Shuppet. Hiswain Growlithe. Ducklet. Rockruff. Seal. Reverse Hall. Spectrier. And a regular Mr. Mime. All right, we're on to Astral Radiance. So far, Silver Tempest is leading the pack. Two good pulls so far. All right, here we go. We have a Psychic Energy. We have Choi, Yan Maga, Gate Jaw Bog, Glammeow, Chadit, Bonita, Cricketot, Psyduck. Reverse Hollow Memoswine and a Starmie V card. Alright. Astral Radiance is trying to come up from the rear. Come on, Astral Radiance, if you get one more, you tie. There's your cook card right there. Alright. Electric Energy. Right, we have a Roxanne, Curlia, Grant, whoops, picked up several cards right there, Mantine, Hiswain Voltorb, Hiswain Basculin, Glammeow, Puchiena, Reverse Hall Scyther, and a regular Registeel. All right, two more packs of Astral Radiance, whoops. There's your cook card right there. I don't know why I did that. <laughs> I'm thinking. I know why I did it. I was thinking for some reason Scarlet and Violet where you don't have to do the superstar. Pure Ugly. O Oopsie. Energy Lotto. Hoot Hoot. Cricketot. Sudowoodo. Combi. Drifloon. Reverse Hollow Hisswain Overquill. And a regular Glaceon. Too bad that's not a good holographic Glaceon. I like Glaceon. Let's see here. All right, we're down to our last pack of Astral Radius. Can I get one more to have Astral Radius tie with Silver Tempest? We will see. But so far, even if I don't outdo uh, the cost of the box, those two cards were worth it. Just like I said. You, don't, you might not be able to outdo the cost of the box, but if you get some really good items in it, it might have been worth it. Dark Tricks. Drift Blim. Trekking Shoes, Glen Meow, Yanma, Nicket, Swinub, Petalil, 
Oh, Radiant Halucha. And oh, there we go. Beedrill V Full Art. So we have double hit right there. So Astral Radiance has taken the lead. Pull these down, put those right there. I pulled like so many Radiant Haluchas. <laughs> I don't know if it's from this set, but I have several Radiant Haluchas. All right, on to Brilliant Stars. So, Astral Radiance is taking the lead with three. Let's see what we get with Brilliant Stars. Again, we still have a chance at that Rainbow Charizard. So, we can try our luck. There's your quick card right there. Wouldn't it be great if we pulled that like the very first pack? Energy! We have a Dusclops. More Grim. Gibite. Corfish. Magmar. Spiritome. Burmy. Stardew. Reverse Hollow Riolu. And a Arg Agron VMAX. Nice. Actually, I think I need him. I <laughs> uh, don't have any VMAX, so I'll put him right there. All right, on to some more Brilliant Stars here. We still have two more packs after this, which means more chances at that Rainbow Zard. We are still uh, trying to pull. I have already pulled it, but uh, hopefully we can pull it again. It's still great to pull great cards. It's part of the magic from Pokemon, in my opinion. Fire Energy. It, I can't explain it more than that. There's like a magic when you pull that awesome card like these, just... It brings back the rush of being a child and getting something amazing. Collapse Stadium, Botoy, Nose Pass, Snow Runt, Dedene, Kupchu, Reverse Hall of Farfetched, and a regular Tornadus. To me, anyway, it's like being a kid again. You're getting some really good cards. You're having fun. You're meeting a lot of new friends along the way. It's again, it's a journey. Pokemon journey. It's a journey. I've met some really cool people. I got to meet Sarah Natticini at a Comic-Con. I got to get her autograph. So it's, it's just a lot of fun. You get to meet the people behind the, the characters from the shows. It's just a lot of fun. All right, here we go. We have Marnie's Pride, Grottle, Bar or Barry, Barry, <laughs> Cherubi, Corfish, Sock, Gullet, Chimecho, <laughs> Oh, there we go, a Zekrom trainer, and oh, we have the Galarian Moltres V Gold card. Woohoo! So, um, not as much as the others. Uh, we're only we're tied at three, but still, it's, it's gonna be kind of hard to beat here. That is a beautiful card, that gold Moltres. I love it, and I actually do need that. All right, everybody, we are down to our last pack. Still. Have not pulled the Rainbow Zard, but I think <laughs> that that was worth it. All right, here we go. Last pack. Fingers crossed. There's your cook card. Energy. All right, we have double turbo energy. Kindler. Print plop. Corfish. Golet, Chimcho, Chimchar, Mencino, Reverse Hall Boltoy, and Ah, oh, and es Escalavia. That's okay. All right, everybody. So, as you can see, these were our pulls. Still a great, great opening, regardless of the prices. But again, the prices are down below. You know how I do this. So, let me know down in the comments below, regardless of what I think. Do you think it was worth it? Whether or not I beat the box price, this was worth it. I got two amazing gold cards. I got a trainer gallery. I got a rainbow rare. Very worth it to me. Head to Walt, uh, excuse me, head to Sam's, Sam's Club. Definitely get one of these boxes. You might be surprised what you get out of them. All right, everybody. So until next video, everybody. Thank you for watching. Thank you for support. Please don't forget out there. Share the channel to help it grow. If you don't, I'll send Gengar to haunt you. Get your geek on, and I'll tell and tell somebody you love them. Until the very next video, everybody. Peace out.